Hey there, it's Keely, and welcome back to my channel. If you've been here before, if not, welcome. So today we have Ariel, one of the royal family members that I made when I was thinking about the castle estate pack, and I'm having you take a look at the castle I made as she gives you a tour. So here is the grand reveal from this side, at least. So let me go ahead and move this here so you can get a better appreciation of what we got going on here. So I'm not the best at making castles, but I tried my best. So we've got the garden area. Here, if I click this, we got the garden area over here. And we've got some horse training stuff. There's some horse uh, areas back in the back kind of hidden here. So you could have a horse as well. A little sitting area is a fountain, the castle itself. And then, of course, we also have the moat, which I have put gators all around the moat. And I don't think you can see any of them right now, at least. There was one up here a little bit ago. Let's see if any of the other gators are out. Uh, so far we are striking out on the gators. Mm, not seeing one right now, but that's okay. We'll find one at one point. So basically what I want to do is use the first person camera to kind of give you a tour of what it looks like to go through this castle, because I think it's absolutely stunning. But before we do that, here is a look of the grounds, just briefly. So we've got our good old, I love how it's just not wanting me to do that okay so we've got this big fountain we've got our little garden out here which I'll have her walk through and I just got some sharks for the garden to show it off a little sitting area back here plenty of pots to grow things we've got the wishing well we've got all a bunch of stuff from romantic garden which is now free you can do the flower arranging skill I've got a little grill kind of hidden in here a little sitting space a place for the kids to play and some more places to sit in addition to a little wild rabbit home so that's kind of here, and then if we go over to this side, ooh, we can turn this on. That's cool. I have yet to use that item for Magic Card stuff. Turn on all park fountains. Hmm. But yeah, so here's a little training area I imagine they could use. And then here is the hidden area back in here. So if we go back here, we've got some wild prairie grass, and we're going to go down a couple levels just so you can actually see this. But yeah, so we've got just a couple things in here, enough for two horse beds, and a couple feeders and stuff. And that kind of gives away some of the castle, but we don't want to give away too much. Alright, so let's go in here and get started with the tour. Here we go, so we're taking our little tour and walk in. It's just so beautiful. Oh my gosh, you can see the little rabbits and everything. Oh, look, there's a rabbit right there. This is so cute. This looks stunning from this view. I tried to go in and change the ceiling, and it tried to delete, like, everything. We got, like, a little staircase over there. It tried to delete everything, so I just gave up, but, yeah. Just stunning. Here's our throne room. Just kind of magnificent. All right, so let's go check out the next part of the house. We're going to go over here. I didn't make a cellar, but I kind of made like a first floor cellar. So here's that in here. Got lots of racks, all that there, some juice fizzing, all that kind of jazz. I thought it turned out really good. Okay, so we're on to the sitting room on the first floor, and so you can see one of them up in here, and you can see the staircase to the second floor, and a little music area we'll look at in a little bit. But here is the main sitting room on the first floor, nice little office space. I thought it turned out beautiful. Got some hobby activities over here, you know, we got the piano, and you could even make some drinks over there. It looks like there's a bunny outside. <laughs> All right, the next part of our tour, we've got the little music area over here. So this is where all of the musical instruments are. I imagine people could come and watch. We've got our main stuff right in here. I thought it looked really pretty. Got the chandelier up there, and then we're going to go ahead and venture upstairs. Okay, so now we're heading up to the second floor with this super grand staircase here. Like I said, I wish I could have painted the ceilings. Oh, you can see some trees up there. Oops. I wanted to paint the ceilings, but uh, it just kind of messed up all of my stuff. 
All right, so we're gonna go in here into the main living space on the second floor first. We get some music going, some chests, some sitting areas, this beautiful window, and plenty of places to sit and kind of relax. I thought it turned out really good in my opinion. So as we leave this living room, we're gonna go ahead and jump into the dining room. So here it is in all its glory. Huge dining space. I love how she's on her phone right now. But yeah, we're gonna take a look into this one of these little secret rooms though too. So this is a little like seance room I put together. Oh, just for fun, like a little yes. office space too. I thought it'd be really cool. So it's kind of hidden. So as we go back out into the dining room, wow, that glitched really bad. We're going to check out the little kitchen, which has the same kind of wallpaper and everything. Super grand, super fancy. We've got these huge islands. Well, we like skipped back into that other room. Huge islands, plenty of space to prepare food and host lots of gatherings here in the castle. Just absolutely majestic. Uh -huh. We've got the first bedroom, which is actually connected here to the kitchen. So we're going to go in here. It's nice and pink. We've got a couple beds over there as we go into this little mini room in between the bathroom here. Nothing too crazy. All right, so as we walk back out, here's another look into the bedroom. You can see the fire there from the thing below. Huh. She's back on her phone again. Mm -hmm. All right, well, we're gonna go upstairs to the next floor. All right, so here's the third floor. Super grand as usual. Oh, we're going in here. So this is one of the main bedrooms. So you can see we have the fancy bed over here. We've got a nice little sitting spot over there. We've got the piano. We've got a nice little sitting spot and a cool little um, closet area and a little sitting spot. All right, so we're going to go over to the next bedroom now, which is right in here. Just a nice little guest room. Oh, it keeps, like, glitching and clipping. But yeah, there's the guest room. Mm. All right, so we're going to walk out of the guest room and into one of the other major bedrooms. There's a bathroom right there on that right, and there was a bathroom connected to the pink bedroom as well. But I just didn't show you that because I thought it would just kind of take a while. Since I'm having her kind of walk into all these rooms and stuff like that and give you a tour, it's kind of complicated so then I can try to get the footage for it because I'm not very good at it, to be honest. Next bedroom in question is in here. It's blue themed. Let me know what you guys think about this style of video, too. Do you guys like this kind of tour? I just sense of the grandness of this castle. I really want to show it off. Our next adventure is going to be a little bit of a surprise in the sense of a surprise access. So we're going to go out here onto this, oh my gosh, that's beautiful, this beautiful balcony. And we're going to go up here, hopefully my game doesn't decide to glitch out. So we're going to go up here, oh, you can just see the plum bob, how wonderful. But yeah, so anyways, she's going to go up here and we're going to access two of the hidden, quote unquote, other hidden rooms here. So we're on top of the castle now. We're going to go into the covered garden space, which is in this room here. So we've got a bunch of little gardening racks and things like that to do some gardening mm -hmm. on. And a nice little place to stay and kind of do... Uh -huh. So walking out of the garden, we're going to go over to the other secret room over here on the top. And this is another bedroom. This one's got a beautiful purple theme. Nice and elegant and jazzy. I really like how this one turned out. Something a little bit different. Nice little place to work. And then that's a bathroom right there. So starting in the throne room, we're going to go out into the garden now. Take a nice walk out these beautiful doors and into the courtyard. I don't know why it keeps glitching like that. It's super weird. All right, we're going to take a nice little walk over here. I guess she's running. All right, so now we're back in the courtyard over here. And then here are shark friends, too. So while she's admiring them, we've got this beautiful garden over here. Plenty of places to sit. If we turn this way, flower arranging table, and then there's a nice little wishing well back in the corner over there. And another place to sit back 
in this area here. Oh. Hopefully you all enjoyed this type of tour through one of my builds. I was pretty happy with how it ended up working out. She's so excited. She's like running out. So we're going to go ahead and walk on out and exit the castle after such a stunning tour through the castle. Hopefully you guys enjoy, and I'll see you in the next one.